Hey guys, so for today's video, I am going to be sharing with you some of the different things that I feed Jack. If you haven't watched any of my other videos with Jack in it, she is a female, and my vet told me that the female bearded dragons tend to be a little bit more picky with what they eat, and they do get more bored and require a change in their diet. And with Jack, she tends to get bored with what she's eating every like three months. Right now, she is currently eating these, and I'll pull them out. They are hornworms, and she's loving them. I joke around with my uh, parents because I tell, I always say like, oh, they're like the flaming on of uh, bearded dragon food. And this is what uh, the hornworms look like. The reason why I say they're like the flaming on of bearded dragon food is because they cost quite a lot compared to the other foods that you can feed them. For 10 of these, they cost $17, which really, but she normally eats about two or three a day. Before she was eating these, and these are super worms, this is what they look like. They are not mealworms. I do not recommend feeding them mealworms because it's all like cartilage and they have a harder time digesting the cartilage. They are, these super worms, they're like, to me I call them the big brother of mealworms. They're a little bit more, they still have like kind of like the outer shell and the crunch, but they're a little bit more meatier for her. And those used to be our favorite up until just recently. And she, I also feed her, I have in here, I also feed her crickets and this is where they, they're kept in this cricket keeper. And she's been recently enjoying those a lot more. I just took her from boarding and they said that she's eating crickets like no other. So those are the three things I feed her. I normally feed her around 3.30. She only eats once a day. She doesn't, I try to feed her, I'll feed her a little bit in the morning and if she's not hungry, when I come back from work I feed her, like I said, around 3.30. I just keep that in, so I keep the red food pellets why is she so obsessed with my hair? My goodness. She's hiding, she's camera shy. Sorry. I also feed her these red food pellets. I just keep these in the tank just for something else. As for veggies, she is the most pickiest thing ever. <laughs> she used to eat collard greens, and then when I got excited and I decided to make this fancy salad from it, she stopped eating collard greens altogether. So currently, she does eat a little bit of kale, and when I mean a little bit, she literally eats like two little things, like little bites of kale, and she's done. And she also eats, I can get her to eat strawberries and raspberries. I don't really consider those a staple in her diet just because they're considered more like treats. And of course, she would like that a lot. But um, like I said, she just hasn't been taking to it. Right now I'm trying to feed her bell peppers. I have a list of fruits and vegetables that bearded dragons can eat and I've been going down it and I got through all the A's. She wouldn't eat any acorn squash or anything like that. So now I'm at bell peppers. And the only reason why I know that she can eat kale is because when I boarded her, that's what they feed their bearded dragons. And they said that she would only eat it when uh, if she was being hand fed. Other than that, they couldn't get her to do anything else. She's also eaten dubia roaches, but she doesn't really like chasing food that much. When I do the crickets, I have to take all of her stuff out for her to actually hunt them down to eat them. If I have all of her stuff in there, she, she's not eating. If I was to rank the foods on what's best for a bearded dragon and what's not as good is Dubia roaches is the best. Hornworms is my second favorite. My third favorite is crickets. They would be, okay, 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 okay. Really? Thank God you're killing me. Oh, she never wiggles when I hold her. It's only when the camera's out she wiggles as much. My third favorite is crickets, and that one used to be my top favorite, but they just poop and they smell really bad, and after a while, if she doesn't eat them quick enough, they start chirping and my parents don't appreciate that at all. My fourth favorite is super worms. That used to be her favorite. And then my least favorite food that I would feed her is mealworms. Like I said, mealworms I do not recommend. I recommend all the other choices I listed above to feed your dragon. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, Jack. If you'd like to give me some advice or even talk to me and say hey, leave a comment down below. And if you'd like to see more of me, please subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. If you like this, oh my god, jeez, if you like